Tesla is surging because of its improving battery business. Tesla has received both an increased price target and an improved rating on its stock from Morgan Stanley after reports of the electric automaker enhancing its battery business as well as hints that uh, there is going to be important announcement on the battery day. Welcome back dear friends. This is Armin Harayan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here for the first time, please subscribe to our channel, like this video to show your appreciation of all our friends who helped me to bring them to you and also please ring the notification bell so you may be updated when I upload my next Tesla story. Morgan Stanley's Adam Jonas increased his price target for Tesla stock by $310 to $1,360 from $1,050 and upgraded his rating for the electric automaker from underweight to equal weight. Based on the body of evidence collected and research conducted by our tech colleagues, we now give Tesla credit for a third-party battery electric vehicle powertrain supply business in our base case, previously in our bull case scenario, that is worth $310 per share, Jonas said in a note to investors. Tesla shares are trading around 3.5% above the closing price on Thursday of 1,621 at the moment. Shares are trading at 1,679 at the time of uh, preparing this reporting and uh, at the pre, uh, in, the, uh, in the market. Tesla's battery developments have been vital to the company's notoriety as the most dominant automaker in the electric car industry. The battery cells the company uses with the help of Panasonic are industry leading and have contributed to Tesla's world-class range and performance standards for its electric vehicles. However, the electric automaker based out of Silicon Valley, California has continued to make improvements to its cells, battery cells, to maintain its dominance over competitors and over consumers a high quality battery that will perform accordingly. Tesla continues to develop its battery technology with the help of a theme from researchers led by Jeff Dunn at Dalhousie University in Canada. But next month, on September 22nd, Tesla will hold its much expected battery day, which will reveal several new developments that the company has come across in its cell research efforts. Jonas from Stanley Morgan believes that battery day could be yet another revolutionary moment in the short but rich history that Tesla has. Here is a quote. The Tesla battery day could be a game changer and based on what we know so far, there is, going, uh, there is growing risk for Tesla becoming a new battery competitor armed with superior technology, Jonas said in the note which was shared by The Street. This week, Tesla Radio reported that Dan and his team of researchers had released a new paper that showed a new electrolyte solution could combat battery degradation. It would also encourage higher energy density in battery cells, which means more range for Tesla vehicles and could help the batteries hold a longer lifespan. Add to this the news that I reported yesterday about the new um, casting machine that has got the presser, Giga Presser at Fremont factory, which is going to cut the cost and weight of the Model Y, and you're going to have better car with longer range. Tesla has also made some moves to its stock this week. The company announced its intention to perform a 5 to 1 split in late August, which will increase the number of shares but reduce the price per share by 80%. This move will encourage younger investors to consider putting money into Tesla's mission. Tesla shares are up over 300% this year so far, which has contributed to the company earning the title of the most valuable car maker in the world. Before I continue, I want to have a disclosure. I have no ownership in shares of Tesla and I have no plans to enter the market and position within the next 72 hours. I'm not interested in stock market very much. But in the meantime, Tesla's battery day hints escalate as Powerwalls reportedly run low on stock. Recent reports from the third party installers have mentioned that 
the supply of Tesla Powerwalls has gotten strangely low as of late, inciting speculations that the electric car maker may be preparing to announce some updates for its battery storage system in the upcoming Battery Day event, which uh, we expect, like I said, to be on September 22nd, uh, 22nd uh, of this year. Reports uh, uh, in the clean, uh, report Tesla Radi. Tesla has been pushing its energy business hard over the past quarters, and in its quarter 1 2020 update later, the company noted that it has installed its 100,000th power, 100, power wall, a landmark milestone for the home battery unit. As noted by a third-party installer on the uh, Solar uh, subreddit, Tesla Powerwall deliveries have actually been very quick during the first half of the year. But as soon as July hit, orders have been delayed and later out of stock. Quite interestingly, the installer further noted that they have now been notified that they would not be receiving power walls until 2021. This was a rather sudden update from Tesla, especially considering that the company has been aggressively ramping its energy business this year and prior to July, power wall supply to third-party installers have reportedly been consistent. It should be noted that customers ordering power walls directly from Tesla have remarked that the home battery system is still available for them. Within this in mind, with this in mind actually, it appears that the company is somewhat reserving a certain portion of its power wall stock for uh, first party installation installations. First party Tesla energy installations have been on the rise as well. After all, especially with the company's efforts to make its solar and battery packages more compelling to customers. Considering these reports, Tesla may be experiencing a stronger than expected demand for the power wall, resulting in the company getting overwhelmed with orders. This is quite plausible as the company has dropped its solar prices back in June. Tesla may also be intentionally clearing its current Powerwall stocks to make way for an updated version of the product in the near future, perhaps one that may be unveiled on the battery day. As noted by members of the Tesla Motors subreddit, Tesla has done a relatively similar strategy when the company rolled out the newest version of its wall connector. If Tesla is following a similar playbook with the Powerwall, then the company may very well be poised to announce some new upgrades for the home battery system soon. What does these updates may be are uh, what these updates may be are merely speculations for now, of course. But it would not be surprising if some tech Tesla's expected million mile battery would be rolled out to the power wall. Electric has an interesting take on all of these battery day, power pack, and Tesla battery enhancement developments. Fred Lambert says a quick message to Tesla shorts: Get out before battery day. By the way. He says he is long on Tesla. So there is an interest here. I wanted you to know. And that's not because Tesla will become a battery supplier like Morgan Stanley suggested. I don't think that's impossible. But if it does happen, it is going to be years down the road, not immediately, late this decade at the earliest in, uh, in his opinion. So he says, as he has reported previously, the real announcement at Battery Day is Tesla's Roadrunner project, which aims to solve battery supply constraints and enable Tesla to launch its many upcoming vehicle programs that are going to be massive battery consumers, namely Tesla Semi and Tesla Cybertruck. Tesla is going to lay out how it plans to not be completely reliant on third-party manufacturers anymore. The automaker is still going to need them for the foreseeable future, but it is going to show a path to supporting itself with its own battery production. Furthermore, we also expect some battery performance improvements being announced at the event battery day, but I think that will actually be second to the scale and cost of batteries that Tesla plans to present at the event. Cost is one of the most important announcements. Can Tesla make electric car batteries which cost less per kilowatt hour 
than $100, which is the parity with gas cars. We also expect Tesla to unveil Model S Plaid at the event, Battery Day event, and there might be a few surprises as well. But at the core of the announcement and what we expect to hear from Tesla at the Battery Day uh, is the real catalyst for the stock is Tesla showing a clear way to scale battery production to solve supply constraints and make batteries that are less costly than making uh, gas cars. Well, friends, let me know what you think about this development, about this surge, uh, surge about the preparations and hits, about battery day, the power wall. In the meantime, this is Armin Haryan from torquenews.com. Let me see your comments. I'll, I'll read them in, in the comment section below. Please subscribe to our channel, uh, like this video to show your appreciation of our friends who helped me uh, bring these stories to you. You can find the references in the description of this video. And also, please notify, uh, ring the notification bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story about Tesla car appreciation. Thank you and have a wonderful day. God bless you and take good care of each other. See you soon, friends.